Yeah, man, that's 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 what we do, man. You know, whenever we you know get together, or, you know, that's what we do to each other, man. We we you know we tear each other down, man. Every chance we get, we you know we just we just appear to be the only ones that do that, man. I'm talking about, man, uh, Monique going off on D.L. Hughley. Now, don't get me wrong, uh, personally speaking, neither one of them, for the most part, have, have ever been that funny to me. You know, D.L. got off, man, uh, by checking people in the audience. You know what I'm saying? And, and that's how he got on. You know, he was never really that fucking funny. You know, he, he got on by checking people in the audience. Monique, you know, uh, she, she, she tells, you know, about personal shit that go on with her and, and, and throw in some jokes here and there, you know, but man, it, it's been many people way more funny than them, but that's beside the point. What I'm talking about is what Monique said towards dude on last night up in Detroit. And I just feel like uh now don't and 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 don't get me wrong. Uh I do feel like she's been blackballed, but I feel like she brought some of this shit on herself. That still don't, you know, justify her being blackballed, though. It, it really don't. Now, she named a whole lot of people that she feel like, you know, was a part of it, you know, which may or may not be true, you know. I mean, after she got her Oscar, man, you would have thought, man, that she would have took off, but, you know. I guess, man, when it was time for her to do certain things, you know, she wasn't getting the kind of money that she thought she deserved. And I guess some folks said, well, you get nothing. You know. But I just I just feel like as grown people, man, uh she could have handled this shit a little bit better, man. She didn't have to blast the man on stage like that now. In regards to the contract that she was talking about, if indeed it said that she was the headliner, then she should have been the headliner. You know, don't don't change the motherfucking contract, goddamn it, man. Oh, uh, once it's time for us to get on stage, and, and now you say, "Oh, uh, look, Monique, uh, uh, we got a little issue. Uh, Dear, he he don't want to get on now. He don't even want to do the show." Unless he's the headliner. Well, fuck him then. Because that ain't what the goddamn contract said. Contract said, I'm supposed to be the motherfucking headliner. And and goddammit, uh, them promoters should have handled it just like that. But no, they ain't going to lose their money. You know. And they figured, goddammit, man, if we made him the headliner, it's a win-win for us. You know. So... We gonna get this motherfucking show on and get paid. What she need to do, if if in fact they did do that, she she need to take their ass to court. And if dude did go to them like that, yeah, it was fucked up. But don't this just me, man. Don't don't wear the man out like that, man. On stage, call that nigga. Man, to give that nigga a piece of your motherfucking mind and let him know, man, that shit wasn't cool at all, bitch nigga. Because that's what you called him last night. You know? We had to stop, man, tearing each other up and down and cutting each other round and round, man, for all the world to see. That's all I'm saying, man. That's... We got to cut it out, man. We need to cut that shit out, man. You know, you you there to tell jokes. <clears throat> Whether you first or last, goddammit, tell your jokes, get paid, take it on to the house. You got an issue, holler at that nigga. <clears throat> That's what these goddamn cell phones and shit for, goddammit. 
If you feel like you can't talk to the nigga, type his ass. Send the nigga goddamn uh DM or something. But cause see now don't nobody wanna fuck with you no more. You know, they 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 really didn't want to fuck with you at all. You know, now you starting to get back on shows and shit like that, but now, you know, you putting yourself in another predicament with these motherfucker uh uh executives and different motherfuckers got down behind the scenes and shit. You know, damn, we put on stage, goddamn, she served the nut up again. Man, people want to hear jokes. You know. That's all I'm saying, pimp. Till next time, family. <laughs>